Hey, good morning everyone. Just uh, got home earlier this morning. Just wanted to do a quick little after action on the uh, California event. Uh, I'm in a car right now, uh, waiting for a, uh, do some paperwork for my job. But I uh, wanted to talk about the fight real fast. Felt pretty good. It was a good uh, decision I can understand because um, I'm uh, basically a seasoned amateur versus a, a pro. So I'm really kind of glad that my odds were even down to split down to one point. That shows that I made a lot of improvement, made some good adjustments for this fight coming up. Uh, I can see why he won. I know a lot of people saying uh, it was a robbery, but it, you, you have to really look at both sides of the spectrum. Uh, especially a lot of you guys that uh, fought in Golden Gloves and fought in amateur boxing. Y'all know exactly what I'm talking about. Like, my style's not scoreboard friendly. Uh, he was more technical. I was uh, a little more flashy. That's not really good for the judge's eye. Uh, also, he, he, did, uh, he did land more... Well, he uh, threw more strikes. I did a lot of shoulder rolling. I was able to block most of them, which is why my body feels like it went through a meat grinder, but I didn't take anything significant. Maybe a couple good left hooks, a uh, good, uh, good couple hits to the body, but I'm not too banged up. I mean, my right hand was smashed. I mean, I even got seen by a doctor. He said, it's not broken. So that was good news. I thought I broke it since the Viking fight. So he says it's just a uh, bad swelling, uh, bad bruising. Just got to ice it up and I'll be good. But it's, it's not going to heal up by July 3rd, which uh, I do owe you guys that win. I mean, I'm sorry for that loss. Sorry I came out and did all that hype just to lose. But I uh, went back to the drawing board. I'm going to fix some things. And uh know it's not going to be enough until July. But I'm going to get you guys that win. I owe you all that much. So stay safe and stay tuned. And uh, I appreciate uh, those that purchased the content, uh, purchased the BLK Prime. Make sure you guys... Uh, Follow their link, follow their uh, Instagram, check them out and support them because you're also supporting Street Beef. So, also, I posted this fight uh, on my YouTube page until they yell at me or until YouTube yells at me about copyright. But uh, you guys owe it. I, I, I'm willing to take a, any risk I can for you guys because y'all support me all this way. So, enjoy the free content while it's there and uh, stay safe and stay tuned. Take care.